Hellgate jet boat excursions gliding into the season at the beginning of May, just as in years past. But there is a change this time around. Hellgate jet boat excursions general manager Travis Hamlin says water levels in the Rogue River keep dropping and open season for this business keeps getting shorter. Just because of the lack of side stream inflow and the lack of water that we're experiencing this year. The side stream flow comes from snowpack. The lack of snow in our region is making the Rogue River shallower year after year. We're keeping a close eye on that. Certainly if it drops low enough, you know, we won't be able to operate. But right now we don't see that as an issue. The tourist attraction brings tens of thousands of people to Grants Pass each year. One of them, Paula Nufri, a foreign exchange student from Ukraine. I'm kind of looking forward to experience, experiencing a boat trip on a river. According to the city of Grants Pass, okay, phone is... there's a lot of people interested in excursions of the Rogue River. It's one of our main attractions for Grants Pass. About 74,000 people head to the city between June and September. During that same time, hotels in Grants Pass average about a 90% occupancy rate. Tourism director John Bowen says Hellgate Jet Boats has somewhat of a ripple effect in the community. As water levels taper, taper down at the tail end of the season, any day that's cut shorter naturally has a, a ripple effect. To what degree, you know, uh, depends on how late it is in the season. Violet continued owner Kathy Marshbank says she definitely gets more business when travelers check out Hellgate Canyon in these jet boats. We can usually tell when they're on their way down to, Hell, down to Hellgate, they either mention it to us or they're dressed specifically for that trip. Dash Bakery owner Ashley Hudson agrees with Marshbank. Thank you. But both business owners agree not all their customers come for a ride on the Rogue. So a short season for Hellgate jet boat excursions wouldn't have too much of an effect on their shops. I think the tourism downtown is great. There's a great push for tourism right now with the um, downtown welcome center. As for weather seasons will keep getting shorter for this tourist attraction, Hamlin says that's up to Mother Nature. Covering your news in Grants Pass, Ariana Rakshani, News 10.